So part one of the Caves and Cliffs update was released just earlier today, and the plan was to not update until Optifine, Replay Mod, Fabric, Optifabric, all that stuff comes out so that I don't have to play without Optifine, Replay Mod, and that stuff. And just in case, you know, there's a bug that just kills you as soon as you open the world, I didn't want to update. But... Since I'm building this castle, I feel like it'd be cool to have some copper and deep slate blocks, because I'm pretty sure that copper and deep slate are in this update. I think the only thing they didn't add is the new caves and the new mountains. I believe the mobs and everything are in the game, as well as the underground biomes? Maybe. So we're going to check. I'm going to go into version 1.17, and we're going to see... We're, we're gonna we're gonna check it out we're gonna see what's up and if the things I want are in the game then we'll update if not we'll stay on 1.16.5 until Optifine comes out because I kind of want some copper in this castle build and now it's time for the first intermission of possibly many in this video I played and did all this video in one single day but there was enough content today to fill up two entire episodes and I'm squeezing it into one. So I might jump in a few times and quickly gloss over some of the lesser important details that happened throughout this episode. But basically I went into a 117 test world to make sure that deep slate, dripstone, and goats, axolotls, and glow squids were in the game. And then after confirming that, I updated the hardcore world to 117. Okay, so my sky texture pack no longer works, so we're back to having a hideous sky, and I can't zoom in. I am pressing the button on my mouse, and it will not zoom in. So this is a awful experience, to say the least. Oh, I can't turn- <gasps> Oh, disgusting. I can't turn on- I can't turn dynamic FOV off. I can't turn off. Oh, I can turn it off. Never mind, I lied. I can't turn it off, thank god. The game looks so much shittier all of a sudden. Is this really what it's like to play without Optifine? It looks so shitty now. What happened? Oh my god, I can't turn off Nether Fog. Oh, it's so disgusting. It's so unbelievably disgusting. But if you don't know how it works, basically none of the chunks I've already loaded in this world will change at all. But if I go to a chunk I have not yet loaded in this world, then it will have the new generation and stuff. So I think I'm going to gear up with the necessary supplies, and then we can head out to the new chunks and start doing 1.17 stuff. I guess we'll just go straight this way. We'll go, like, way out here somewhere, and we'll just make a new portal and hope we get into new chunks. Please do not die. I'm holding two totems of undying, because that's how scared I am that something's going to go horribly wrong. No! Get me off the ground. Okay, 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 okay. Where are we? Negative 22,000, negative 15,000. I think we're in new chunks, but I don't know, really. I honestly don't know if we're in new chunks or not. Goats! We found some. We found some. Oh, hey guys. Uh, that's a lot of you guys. Uh, let's do this. We'll screenshot these cords and we'll come back to you later. How about that? I want to get, like, a squad of axolotls and just roll up on a monument and just fuck the shit out of everyone. I'm really not finding any glow squids, though. Oh, God. Don't do it, game. Don't make me. Please don't make me explore a desert when I'm supposed to do 1.17 stuff. Oh, God. I, I'm not even looking for them right now, and I find them. What do you mean? What are you talking about? God damn it! I'm not looking for you! Stop! I'm here for 1.17 stuff! No, I'm going away from the desert. I'm getting away from that desert. I don't care how many enchanted gapples it has. I'm not getting distracted by a desert. Not this time. I'm gonna try to find a cave to start exploring. That's... That is copper! Okay. <gasps> no way! Oh my god! Wait, oh my god. They took me so long to find. They took me so long to find in the creative world. There's no way I'm leaving these guys. No, get in the water. Please get in the water. 
How long can I axolot? Wait, I can get them in buckets, can I? I can get them in buckets. Oh my god. Give me. Yes! No. Thank god. Oh my god. We got axolotls. I really was worried about getting them. Holy. I forgot you could put them in buckets for a second. Now we can bring them back home and we can get a controlled area to breed them in. So, that's very relieving that we got... That we got axolotls now. Oh, is that dripstone? That's dripstone, isn't it? This is a dripstone block. Let's go. We got some. Thank God. Oh, <gasps> this is the name of this geode. Oh, I was checking to see if there were any glow squids, and we found amethyst. Oh, that's so nice. That's so nice. Um, so okay, so. Amethyst only grows on these, I'm pretty sure. So, I think we have- We are gonna be forced to come all the way out here if we ever want to farm this stuff. Which sucks. Yes! We got one! Give me. Thank you. More dripstone- oh. Ow, I need to be careful. I need to be careful around these things. Oh, yeah, I need to be real careful. Because these things are brutal. But I want to get as much tough dripstone deep slate as I can before I go back to old chunks. I don't want to have to fly the way out here again. Oh, this is deep slate? That's deep slate. I didn't get any new recipes though, which is a little weird. I'm really kind of disappointed that glow squids don't just spawn with the coral reef. Like, it would be so cool. As I was saying... Oh my god! It's Cheryl! It's Cheryl, the long lost sister of Beryl, Harold, and Gerald! It's Cheryl! Oh my god! How the hell am I gonna get you home? Oh my god! Are you kidding me? Of course, Cheryl has to spawn tw 20 at negative 24,000, negative 16,000. Are you kidding me? You couldn't have spawned elsewhere? You really had to spawn here? Get the hell away. You can't touch Cheryl. Long story short, I really like chickens that spawn in the middle of the ocean. Cheryl. Alright. You are now Cheryl. So with the appearance of Cheryl, that's when I decided it was about time to go back home. But I also want to make it clear that between each of these clips you've seen, I was killing extra glow squids, mining some more deep slate, getting some other items from the 1.17 update. But I just wanted to show you kind of like my first initial reaction to everything, which is why you'll see I have more glow dye and stuff like that. But kind of complicated situation here as to how I got everything home. Because of how passive mobs spawned, I'm pretty sure that goats would only spawn in new terrain, unlike axolotls and glow squids, because they are the kind of passive mobs that don't despawn and only spawn once. So I made a portal to the goats, and one to Cheryl on the nether roof, and then I met up with the two parties, and then I walked 5,000 blocks home on the nether roof and got them to the spawn island. Yes! Yes! Oh my god! There it is! Home! Sweet! Home! Cheryl, you come over here. You're gonna be here with Harold. Hey guys, go! Harold and Cheryl together! Now, I realize, because these guys can just jump, I can't really contain them. Like, I can't just fence them in somewhere because they'll just jump right out. So... I, I I don't know where I'm where I'm gonna put them. I guess I'll put them on the old mushroom. Remember where the mushrooms used to be? I guess I'll put them up here. What should we name them? I feel like one of them has to be named Billy. Like you can't have a goat and not name it Billy, right? So you will be Billy. <laughs> I'm so funny. You get it? You get the joke? So you're Billy and you were Barbara. <laughs> I'm so hilarious, dude. I'm so funny. I, I can see why you guys watch me now, because I'm so funny. Can you tame goats? Can you, like, tame them? Okay, I just need literally five wheat to give to each of them, and they'll... They'll t be tamed. Okay, so it's not five. Oh, God, they're breeding. Uh, 
Yeah. Oh my god. I'm not killing it then. I'm not kill. Okay, I'm sorry. I am fucking sorry. Okay, I'm not gonna kill the goat. It genuinely scared me. Like I was not expecting that. Why did you do that? You are a asshole. <laughs> you are a dumb fuck. So if I write something, so the advancements. I forgot. I haven't completed any every advancement anymore. Uh oh. That's something we gotta do in this episode as well. I need to breed axolotls to re get two by two. There's one food item I'm missing. So I'm gonna pretty much go through the advancements I do complete in this video at a rapid fire pace. However, around this time, I began breeding axolotls because I wanted to go on a conquest. I had a dream of an army of axolotls by my side rushing towards an ocean monument with me and taking it down as a team that was the goal for the end of the episode and while that's going on i might as well finish up all the advancements i have left to complete yeah and then whatever floats your goat there we go i want to start breeding axolotls though i need to name the first two as well the first two axolotls need to be named these two will be the commanders of my axolotl army so one of them needs to be General Nibbles. <laughs> General Nibbles is one of our axolotls. Colonel Socks. <laughs> so we have... We have Colonel Socks and General Nibbles. Okay. <laughs> Quite the names, I, I will admit. So they should be fine, just in here. No, 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 no. Breed. <laughs> Look at those little wiggle towards each other. So this is the this is the first baby. Okay. So we should probably name the first one as well. We should probably name this guy. This guy can be Captain Wiggles. There we go. Captain Wiggles. So Colonel Sox and General Nibbles are the parents of Captain Wiggles, who is third in command. <laughs> this is so fun, dude. I'm having so much fun. Parrot. You know, I think my ocelots are over here. The ones that I bred. Nope, they all died. Maybe I shouldn't have left them in a hole to starve to death. Come on, socks. It's time. Whoa! 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 Relax! Jesus! Can you chill? God, what was that? There it is. Easy. Yes! Yes! Okay, I need to get hungry to eat them, but we got them. Yes, here we go. There we go. Finally. No, I forgot about that. I forgot about that. Did I get it? I still got it. That, and then it's that. And with that, I believe there were only two more advancements I had left to get. One of them I needed a thunderstorm for, and the other one I needed snow for, so that I could fill up a cauldron. However, later, after some experimenting, I determined that there is a bug which is not allowing me to collect powder snow, which I need for one of the advancements. So I gave up on that one, and I did not get a thunderstorm in this video, so that one will come at a different time. Figured I'd do a little progress update. This is how many axolotls I have. However, I looked it up. And I found out axolotls can despawn if they have not been spawned from a bucket. So, if they're in a bucket and I put the bucket of axolotl down, I, like, put it on the ground, then the axolotl will no longer despawn. But if the axolotl is not spawned from a bucket, like, if I just breed two axolotls and let the baby go, if it's not name tagged or in the bucket, it can despawn. So, what I've been doing is I've been going through a lot while I've been waiting to breed them again, and I've just been picking up each axolotl and putting it back down. I've just been clicking on every single one of them to make sure that none of them despawn. And I actually have seen a few spawning in the ocean over there. Like, I got a group of four, I got, like, another group of three, then one spawned, then another two spawned, or something like that. There were quite a few. So, 
yeah, it's kind of it's kind of crazy how much we're getting here. I want this lake filled with them. I need to do some looking into how axolotls will follow me because I feel like having them all on leashes is a bad idea. So now I'm going to go back to my work, just picking them up, putting them down, breeding them when I can. Pretty much just that while I'm waiting for a thunderstorm to happen. This is how my axolotl army is doing, if you were curious. Yeah, this is, this is what they are. I think I'm gonna go with this. I also found this guy. I don't know if he's rare, because he's, like, different from all the rest. Because, as I said, some were spawning over there in the water a few times, shockingly. And I think he was one, I, I guess I didn't really pay attention. I assume he was one of the ones I found over there, because he's different colored. But... Yeah, this is the Axolotl army. The three we originally caught are in here somewhere. Oh, there's General Nibbles. And once this rain stops, we're going to go take down a monument. We are not going to go for a monument we haven't explored, though. We're just going to go to the one that's right nearby, because if we didn't, like, I don't think I would be able to make it, like, all the way to an unconquered monument without losing significant if it's really easy i will i'll try but i don't think it's really going to be easy to just go to a faraway monument you know my army when we approach the monument you will organize into your groups you've already been assigned the general captain and colonel are your leaders the three groups will roll out separately take out as many guardians as you can some of us may die but that is a sacrifice i'm willing to make because we will not let these guard. I'm getting too into this. Let's just go. Okay, let's start. Let's start getting as many as we can. Oh, Jesus. This is going to be... A There's going to be too many, dude. This is not going to work at all. Oh, God. Why do they do that? <laughs> oh, I saw... Colonel Sox, come on. What is going on? Jesus. This is not going to work. There's no way I'm going to get nearly every single one. There's Captain Wiggles. We got Captain Wiggles. Okay, where's the, where's the general? We need the general. I can't- There he is, there he is! Did I get him? I think- I got the general, I got the general. We do need some to stay behind to guard the, uh, the base, obviously, so... Maybe it's best that we leave some behind. There's so much noise that it doesn't even render the stone breaking. My army! Let us go! Let's go! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> oh my god! This is nuts! Let us go. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, this is crazy. March forward, men. <laughs> Here we go. This is so crazy. This is one of the coolest things I've done in this game. Get him. Get him. Oh my god. Kill him. What is he gonna do? Huh? What are you gonna do? Get him. <laughs> Get him. Get him. Get the guardians. Get as many as you can. Look at this, dude! Look how crazy this is! Oh my god! I saw the colonel. The colonel's still alive. This is kind of a failure. They aren't really doing what I was hoping they would. Get him! Get him! Yes! We got it! I can't shoot without hitting my own men. We still have so many. Get to the center. We must hold the center point. Oh my god! Get them all. No, there's a lead. One of them died. One of the axolotls is dead. Kill them, men. Kill them. Captain Wiggles, the captain is still alive. Yeah, they got one. Yo. What are they doing? They're freaking out, dude. They don't know what to do. I know the captain's still alive. I don't know about the colonel and the general, though. I got hit. Men, they take the hits for me. Oh, my God. Holy shit. Look at this army. Kill them. I'm taking too many hits. I don't like it. My men, you must kill them. Yes, we got one. Keep going. There's a trident. No. Back off. You may not hurt them. Who is that? Who is that? They're getting on attack. They're getting detached. No. No. The oh my god. The pufferfish. No. Men, come back! So many of our brave soldiers are still fighting. We must re-enter the fray, my friends. No! No! Come back! Kill him! Get him! 
Yes! We're winning. We're winning, guys. Is that the... I saw the colonel. The colonel's alive. No! Men, retreat. Let us retreat, men. We will come back another day and claim more of the evil guardian's lives. But for now, we must rest. If Nibbles, Socks, or Wiggles are dead, I don't know what I'm going to do with myself. I don't know how I'm going to continue playing in this world. Genuinely. Nibbles is alive. I saw Nibbles. So many of our axolotl friends are escaping. And they're never going to despawn because they were spawned from a bucket. My friends, you must return to us. Return to service in the army. They've all been contained so we can break this now. Wiggles is alive. Wiggles is alive. I'm pretty sure the general is alive as well. General Nibbles is alive. Socks? Where is Socks? Socks was a yellow one. None of the yellow ones are Sock. No. Socks? He's alive! <laughs> we got them all! They're all still alive! What? How are they still alive? I can't believe we we got back with every single one of the main axolotls. That is nuts, dude. We actually fucking did it. Oh my god. That was crazy. That was that was so much fun, dude. I was not expect I was expecting at least one of them to die, if not all of them. The only two advancements we have left are just going to come with time and I assume bug fixes because it really seems like powdered snow just doesn't work like I was testing it in my creative world and it was not working I changed I sped up the game I sped up the random tick speed nothing was working so I think something with powdered snow is bugged to where I can't get it and the storm well that'll come with time so thank you all for watching this episode of Minecraft Hardcore if you enjoyed be sure to leave a like to let me know and subscribe if you want to see more videos from the series and content similar to this see you guys next time